guys, we're here today to talk about the Fibonacci series. Now you may have never heard of the Fibonacci series, but I know you've heard of the Pythagorean Theorem. And when you are learning about the Pythagorean Theorem, I'm sure your teacher mentioned the Golden Rectangle. What they may not have told you is that the Golden Rectangle is defined by numbers in the Fibonacci series. Now those Fibonacci numbers are found everywhere in nature. Okay guys, let's take a closer look at the Fibonacci series now. Let's start by looking at the first eight numbers in the sequence. The sequence starts 1, 1, 2, 3, 5, 8, 13, and 21. Now, we all know that to find the next number in a sequence, we have to find the pattern in the numbers previously in the sequence. So let's look at the difference between consecutive numbers. What's the difference here? 1. The difference between 3 and 2 is 1. The difference between 5 and 3 is 2. The difference between 5 and 8, 3. 13 minus 8 gives us 5, and 21 minus 13 gives us 8. Now check that out. We're starting a whole new Fibonacci sequence. Okay, so what does that tell us? That tells us that any given number in the Fibonacci sequence, let's call it F sub n, is equal to the sum of the previous two numbers, which would be F sub n minus 1 plus F sub n minus 2. And that is your fifth. Thank you. 